students here today are participating in the International Butterfly Project. That is an education and arts program that goes on worldwide where children paint a ceramic butterfly that represents the 1.5 million children that were murdered during the Holocaust. Boris was born in 1936. He lived in Riga, Latvia. His mother's name was Asia. I feel like it's important that we should remember the people in the Holocaust because many of these people were really young and many were kids and we should like focus more on them. And when we paint a butterfly, it's like a remembrance for them. I made this butterfly for Eula Kravitz, who was born in 1939 and was last seen in Showa, but his death location is not known. Um, I chose to create this butterfly with yellow, purple, and red because in Diary of Anne Frank, a diabetic girl in the Holocaust, yellow was one of the only colors that brought happiness to the people that, in, that were, that, to the Jews, and purple really complements yellow. Students naturally gravitate to the arts, and through the Butterfly Project, students are able to make artistic choices that connect with history and remembering others. I really enjoy what I'm seeing. A few of the kids had a lot of information already about the Holocaust, and I think it being children affected them. When we learn the Holocaust in a personal way, we remember it, we own it, we feel it. The Holocaust wasn't about six million people that died, it was about each person being an individual. Each person had a story. Each child of the 1.5 million children had a future. We don't know what they would have been. And it's our obligation to remember them and to honor them.